What's going on YouTube, GSNoid here, so in today's video I have great news for those of you who are waiting for the Cilio or Cilio Cydia alternative. It's finally coming for the general public. This video is brought to you by Wondershare and their software PDF Element 6, which allows you to edit, create and convert PDF files on your Mac. Check the program out in the link below and don't forget to check out their advent calendar where you can win prizes until the Christmas. So just a few hours ago, Coolstar has posted, quote, DPKG has been updated to version 1.19.2. Cilio Beta will be rolling out very soon as an optional install for Electra users and will use the latest version of DPKG and apt. He then followed it up with this, quote, It's been quite a journey, but it's nice to finally be able to have semi-public beta testing for Get Cilio, which is pretty much the Cilio CD alternative. Hopefully now the testers will enjoy the speed and user experience that I've been having with the Cilio so that we can have a smooth public beta followed by a release. So finally we're going to see the Cilio. The official Cilio account has posted, quote, All submitted Cilio native depiction and featured packages submissions have been processed and are now live. Initial Cilio beta copies will be going out shortly with public beta testing soon. And then of course they followed up with quote, we will be allowing paid packages to be featured on Cilio feature tab shortly, starting with packages on Dynastic repo with support for other repos hopefully coming soon after. So as you can see Cilio is finally getting to the point where we can finally test it and of course see what's the difference compared to Cydia. For those of you who are not in the loop I'm going to try to explain explain very quickly what Cilio is, but of course you can go ahead here on their um, on their Twitter page and you're going to see some screenshots of it and so on. So what it is is pretty much a package manager just like Cydia, but of course it mimics the iOS 12 design and it has a very very fast interface where you can download very quickly all your tweaks and so on. It has new features like for example you can uh, pretty much give a review to the tweaks you install and so on. It's a very interesting idea. And it started back when Cydia was pretty much broken back in the summer in July 2018. This is when the Cilio project started and as you can see it's been quite a few months since July and it hasn't been released for the public yet. However, it's been in development and apparently we're going to see very, very soon a public beta release that we can test and I will test it here on the channel and I'm going to show you what the differences are compared to the uh, Cydia. However, in meantime, Cydia caught up and it has been updated by pound to own in order to work properly with iOS 11 and of course to be fast and to work normally. So yeah, nowadays Cilio has very big competition with Cydia if it gets released because Cydia is no longer broken, Cydia is no longer behaving badly on iOS 11, it has been updated to work properly. So yeah, there will be a little bit of a battle between Cilio and Cydia. But yes, if Cilio does work as intended and if it really is what they hype it to be, then of course a lot of people will probably use it. And I'm going to try it, I'm going to switch to it and of course try it here on the channel so that you can make an informed decision. Anyways, it's coming soon and it's been the longest developed project of this kind, you know, an apt package manager and one of the things that it has better than Cydia right off the bat is that it can use the newest version of DPKG and apt while Cydia is stuck with some, you know, internal mumbo jumbo required in order to make it work on older platforms and in order to maintain compatibility and so on. So yeah, this one can work with the newest and greatest DPKG and apt which does give it a little bit of advantage. Anyways we're going to wait for the public beta so that we can see exactly what it is up to. Thank you for watching I'm Geosnow. Do not forget to subscribe to stay updated and peace out.